what, what were your thoughts overall? <sighs> it was a tough game. Um, against a very good team. Um, I mean, that's an NCAA team. And, and unfortunately, you know, it's, it's probably unlikely that, they, that they'll be going. But that's an NCAA caliber team. Uh, their front four is as dangerous and dynamic as any in the country. And we faced some of the best in the country. Um, they're a good team. And, you know, going down, we were disappointed with the goal we gave up. Um, and it was just going to take, like, a, a strong effort. Tactics, all of that went out the window. It just was going to come down to good check time. Could we find a way to get back into the game? And um, I made a couple of changes at halftime. We changed our system at halftime just so we could get a foothold on the game because in the first half, I never felt we got the ball. We couldn't really get hold of it. And when we did, we couldn't keep it. And I, I changed things a little bit. And then we started to slowly get into it. And then I think we finished the strongest. Um, you know, I think probably we had maybe besides the, the goal, I think we probably had the two best chances when the keeper made a couple of saves from breakaways. I think one from Caitlin Farrell and maybe one from Grace. Um, so I felt overall, and I say this all the time, if it was a boxer match, we would have won this on points. Um, but it went down to PKs. And I mean, it's a cruddy way to lose a game. But we lost two of them last year. So we know exactly what those poor kids are, 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 are feeling. Um, but you know, someone has to win them and, and someone has to lose them. So today was our time. So obviously a mental side with DePaul is actually have seven games you haven't beaten them. And yeah, yeah, you know, you know yeah. I mean, you know, it's 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 they they seem to be our bogey team. Um, we've had some games with them when we should have beat them, um, but the last couple of years, I mean, I think our three regular season games up till this year was a, was a draw, and and they tended to nip us in the tournament. So this year, um, <laughs> they smacked us here in the regular season. Uh, so, so today was obviously, uh, we'll go down to the record book as a draw, but it feels like a win. Disappointed that the girls didn't work the goalkeeper uh, until you kind of got back and got the equaliser. Yeah. It looked like, you know, the... I always like felt there was stuff spot. there. Yeah, I felt, I felt, especially in the second half with this sun and stuff, I, I felt there was something there for us. Um, and we just never did. I mean, I think the field's a little bit bumpy this time of year, and it's hard to kind of get that perfect touch for a perfect shot or a perfect cross and um, it just it wasn't pretty matchup against Marquette on Sunday and you won 2-0 there in the regular season so um, I've always said for us uh, the road to the Big East Championship always goes through Marquette they're the team that has the most pedigree they're the team that has the most trophies and they've rebounded strongly this year they have a very good team and uh, we had a tough game with them out there in Marquette uh, we scored a couple of good goals and, and, and did a good job defending what they do well. Uh, but Sunday's a different game. I mean, both teams are going to be tired. Um, you know, it's, it's probably going to come down to maybe a mistake. So we have to hope it's on their side.